Hello again, friends and onlookers. Conrad Zimmerman here, trying to go to hell once more in the daily challenge for December 5th, 2013. I didn't upload yesterday's because it was five minutes and, and made me feel like less of a man. So I just said, screw it, not doing it. That was incredibly stupid and lucky. The way I bounced off of that skeleton. And oh my god! Spikes everywhere. Ah! Oh, this is not how I want to start this. And this little bastard up here. Alright, so you know, we're just gonna. Oh, fucking everywhere. Why, God? What did I do? What did I do to deserve this? Oh. Move it, spider. Alright. Pick up our little puppy. This way, spider. That's right, out in the open where we can see ya. Alright, clear those snakes, grab 500. I left that chest up there, but oh well. I can't... Can't be bothered, not with all of these threats to my person everywhere. Okay. That skeleton is just gonna do his thing. Boom. Can't resist blowing something up if I can. Oh no, please don't get up. Okay, good. Because that would have been just the icing on this stage. A scary 1-1! One, one. But we're through it. We're still alive. And uh, that puppy's going to take a, a shot in the back. Thanks, puppy. Coming with me. Get that bat out and dealt with. Down we go. And what's in the shop? I always like to look ahead. Ooh, a bomb shop. Okay. Drop the puppy. Pick this up. Pick the puppy up. Drop the pup, pick the puppy up. Thank you, puppy. Oh my god. That was pretty awesome. Okay. Well, I could buy bombs. You know what I will? I'm gonna buy bombs just because I like having a good supply of bombs. That I probably won't wind up using all of because I will die in a shameful and embarrassing manner. I don't know if you've seen the show before, but guess what? There's a theme. Oh, gotta use a rope to get out of here. Alright, get out of there, puppy. Not gonna leave that $1,200 gem. Out we go. Yay! We survived one too. How depressing that that's something we celebrate. Okay. Ooh. I'm just gonna set that trap off. Thank you for facing that direction, Snake. I'm gonna pick this arrow up to deal with the other arrow trap. Because that's just nasty. And we found the chest containing the Ujadai. Which we will drop to set off another arrow trap. Yay! Hello, scorpion. Hmm. Okay, so, thankfully we have lots of bombs, so it shouldn't be an issue to use one to take care of this little fella. There you go. Enjoy that. Merry Christmas. Hey, free bomb paste! Or that dude in the shop is just seething, seething, and having witnessed me deny him a sale. That's right. DIY ethic, MFR. Okay. No key yet. I'm worried that it was trapped behind this shop on a higher level. Don't have a whole lot of rope. Just enough to hang myself with. Hey. Okay, so it was not in here. That's not good. 
Grab that. And let's hop up here. Maybe we can look up above a little bit. Let's see. Nope, not there. At least not in a readily visible area there. It would have to be at the very tippy top. That's not good. How will I find the black market other than blind luck? Oh yeah, that's right. There was a vault on this. Oh man, that's brutal. Okay. I can do this. I think I can. I think I can. I think I... Oh, there it is. It's right there. By the entrance. I totally just could have walked left right from the beginning and you know, it would have been fine. Alright, fine. You know, and somebody watching this saw it there too, I'm sure. When I came in, they're like, Oh, the key's right up at the top, asshole! So, you know. Thanks for not being that guy. Appreciate it. And we out. Before we have to deal with any ghostly shenanigans. As it is, things have gotten a little dark. I saw a shrine down there. Like shrines, like sacrificing people. It's a hobby. Thank you. I like, I, you know, the, the dark levels suck navigation wise and visibility wise, but gall darn it, if they ain't profit opportunities. I've picked up uh, a couple of these glowy guys that do the glowing and are worth lots of money. I don't like this. Aha! I was right not to like that. That was a death trap in the making. Yeah. Thank you. Got paid dollar dollar bill. And we are still alive, thankfully. I heard the puppy. Uh, there we go. Okay. I heard the puppy, but I wasn't going to go hunt it down. Not when I have an excellent compliment to bombs and... Ooh, hello. Well, oh, hello. Well, speaking of opportunities... Uh, we're gonna kill this guy. I want to drop the corpse down so I can take it to the shrine, but you know I just I, I can't be bothered to Try and get him down there alive plus I want to be sure that for certain I get the, uh, the puppy on the there so we'll just Oof. All right, let's see if we can Hey, cool that worked And hello puppy we're going to take you to a better place. Thank you. That will make it easier to get back. Oh, hello! We found the uh, exit to the black market also. Well, this is just a very, very productive stage. Yeah, we'll put a bomb here. So we can get down a little bit. Right here. Well, okay. Dum 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 dum. Neat. Now this is usually what kills me, but I'm gonna do a little more exploring. Let's see if I can find someone else to sacrifice. Not a lot of exploring. Just just a little. Just a, a teensy teensy bit. All right. I didn't see anybody. So screw it. We're going to the black market. Hmm, now we don't have enough money to buy that onk, sadly, but, oh my god, oh, oh god, a whole bunch of these guys, a few bombs, more bombs, I'm gonna buy a shotgun, thank you, I'll be using it to kill you momentarily. And, ooh, rope. I need rope. That's good. We 
just firing down here. Yep, there we go. Finally got him. I had this exact same scenario in a warm-up game I played before recording, where there was a, well, almost the exact same scenario. Um, instead of uh, just a regular shop, there's also a damsel uh, shop, a kissing booth in the front there. And it was uh, not good, because I got caught up on the bodies. That level had a, that level had a jetpack, which makes it better than this level. But we'll take a cape. For now. Really? None of you guys can pick up that shotgun on the ladder? There's three of you there. There's, like, three of you with three shotguns, and they're all... But there you go. That's the spirit, guys. We up all night to get violent. Got him. Yay. Okay, so we're going to pick up our... Bootay. And... You know, there was rope there. And I feel like I should get it. But, oh, I feel like that's just going to be the death of me. And I have a cape, and I have uh, climbing gloves, and I should just be happy with what I've got, right? Yeah. I think that's the plan. Let's just get out of here before things get any worse. See, I'm learning lessons, guys. That's the whole point of this. Is that I learn from my mistakes. My many, many egregious, awful, terrible mistakes. 2-3. Boom. Dead frog. Boom. Dead frog. Haha. -ha. Monkey and piranha tank. Okay, we have successfully managed to not kill ourselves yet. Operative word, sure. Won't deny it. But I have a feeling we can not kill ourselves a little bit longer. Boom. Money I don't really need. I don't know why I did that. I mean, I've got lots of bombs. I guess it doesn't really matter. I just, I saw two red gems and I thought to myself, I can't let that pass. Hmm. I don't like this much. Boom. Fuck, he caught me! How do you do that? Screw it, I'm out of here! Didn't even stop to pick up a shotgun, you know why? Because I knew if I did, it would be death. I'm learning things! Fuck. Me in the goat ass. Alright. Let's let him out. Thank you very much. For the jetpack. And what the hell, a freeze ray. Why not? Ooh. And a very good opportunity. I guess I didn't need to use that bomb. Would have been better if I hadn't. Yes, do that one more time. Thank you. Let's get our... Fudge monkey. Our lovely damsel. Because, like I said, that other stage was full of opportunity, and now it's... Oh, no! Oh, gosh, my game keeps freezing, and I don't know why. It's freaking me out. Now I have a Kapala, and I I don't want things to go wrong now. And, wow, he is really in a bad spot. If I want his shotgun. And, and, I, and I do do want a shotgun pretty badly. Yes! Got him! Ha ha! I am all that is man. Just blow it up. That's my motto. I have a shotgun now. And I need an exit. I hope. 
Oh, god damn it, I have died. Alright, not going to hell. So be it. Let's see where we go today. Because um, we still have a lot of opportunity in front of us. You know, the world is our oyster. We've got mad... Mad opportunity. What with the shotgun I'm holding, the four health I've got, the jetpack on my back. The world is my oyster, is what I'm saying. Oh, and I guess that guy finally bit it. Neat. Thank you for dying. Wow. That was a very convenient spike trap. Okay. Out of the jungle, into the ice caves. Oh, we could do the worm. You want to do the worm? Let's do the worm. Worm sounds like fun. Just set our shotgun there. And we'll pick up our faithful puppy friend and let's go to the worm. Very useful there. And we're gonna move down. Moving down, moving quickly, not wasting a whole lot of time because this place is scary as hell. See all this stuff moving around? It is making me deeply, deeply uncomfortable. Okay. Boom. This thing's pretty cool. Makes my whip awesome or something, right? I think so. My real interest is the exit. Which I am... trying to approach quickly. Very quickly. Uh, okay, alright. Uh, oh god. Oh god. Alright, I'm still alive. Still alive. Almost certainly thanks to the Kapala. I can't figure out any other reason why I should still be in any thing resembling more than, or one than, less than one piece, or pieces. I should be in pieces. Multiple pieces. I am still in one. That's what I was getting at there. I speak words good. I made it through. I didn't find Meepoy, but I made it through. There you go! See, I don't totally suck at this. Just kind of a lot. Totally just slaughtered that, uh, that puppy. But you know, it had to be done. Whew. Nearly had a very angry collie. Nearly had a very frozen me. Oh darn. I was hoping to bounce him directly onto the uh, the shrine, because that would have been neat. Woo! I don't know why I'm dicking around with this. Lord knows I've got bigger problems ahead. Like a temple. I could do the uh, mothership. Why not? Let's just make this a whole thing. Yeah. Alright. Let's do the mothership. I'm feeling productive. Feeling like I could, I could accomplish something. Probably not the mothership, but, you know, it's worth a shot, right? So long, sucker. Okay. Oh, we gotta get away from that guy. Shotgun's working out pretty well for me, though. Yep, I am, oh, well-armed, 
Very dangerous. Not taking shit from no turrets. Yeah, I know you're onto me. You know what? We're doing it this way. We're clearing a path. You know why? Because we can. Because we got bombs. Alright, dead shopkeeper. That makes that easier. Now I can just walk out the door here. But that would mean not attacking this thing. And, and I had to do that. Because he's got mad loot! Look at all that mad loot! Woo! And a plasma rifle! That I won't use, but I'll pick up because it's not in my journal. Because this isn't my old save file anymore. Woo! Man, what a productive day this has been! Mothership completed! People are going to be impressed as hell! You're like, damn, why can't he play like this all the time? Nice! Double sacrifice! That was pretty great. She should be happy with me. I've given her everything. You hear me? Everything! What does she give me in a turn? A glove and an admittedly awesome thing that transforms blood into health. So, I guess it's fair. Shut up! Boom. More bombs! Yay! I like bombs. Woo! Squishy blood! And there's the onk spot that I won't get to use. But we're building up some health just to be on the safe side. Boom. Oh, hello, shopkeeper. Forgot about you guys. In my excitement over how successful I've been. This, that music's still playing, and that makes me... Oh, there's a... Guy and a thing over here. Well, you're not much of a threat to me. I'm sorry. Right... Come with me, puppy, if you want to live. And I'll just go pick my shotgun back up, because I don't have to lose it in this stage, because I'm not going to hell. Into the temple. Da-da-da-da. And there is Anubis. We do not like him. Sam, we are. Uh, I don't like that thing either. Shit, that's not where we wanted the bomb. Boom. That shopkeeper has not noticed I am here, and we're gonna exploit that. Bombing our way down the floor. That was luck. Totally luck, and I'll take it. Mmm. Cutting that close. Made no money on that stage. A poor capitalist. That's right. As long as everyone faces the wrong direction, we're going to be just fine. Oh, fire guys. I hate them. I'm not a fan of this either, but what the heck? It's a strategy. Might work. Okay, we're gonna just bomb out the floor here. Alright. Out we go. Yay! Whew! That was tension-filled. 4-2 completed. We might make it all the way 
to... Oh, not like that we won't. Shit. Okay. I did not see that arrow trap, and I have paid a heavy price for it. Because now my shotgun is... Woo! That was almost very bad. Almost very bad indeed. Yeah, we're just going to stick a bomb there and get the hell out of here before we get in any more trouble. Down, down, down. Ha! <laughs> fire guy killed the uh, mummy. Because mummies are weak versus fire. And that's the problem with being made of rot. <sighs> yeah. And that's four three. We've we've made it to Olmec. Not too shabby, Conrad. Huh? Yeah. See, yeah, I'm not not that bad. Really bad. Right. Yeah, throw a rope up here. Have a look, see at what we've got. I mean, I guess I didn't need to use the rope. I just didn't like using rope. I only really have two left, and I should probably hang on to them. Oh, who knows? Maybe I'll get some rope. Wouldn't that be a treat, guys? If I got some rope out of this whole affair. Hey, look, rope! Totally shocked. This was a real revelation for me. More bombs. You know what? I'm not going to do that. That seems like a bad idea. Oh, well, it wasn't that big of a deal. So I just thought, hmm, you know, having another obstruction there, maybe maybe that isn't productive. I'm just going to put this in the middle so that I don't knock it anywhere. Hey, more rope! Cool! I'm just... Don't, don't mind me, Olmec. I'm just getting paid. I gotta get mine, you know what I'm saying? Okay, now that I have more or less gotten mine, it's time to get yours. Come on, right this way. Woo! I got 27 bombs and I know how to use them. No, really, I, I do. I know exactly what I'm going to do. This way. Come here. Really? This is too high? Oh, you dick. Will that work for you? Thank you. You just stay right there in the corner. I'll set everything up for you. <sighs> Dropping bombs. Yup. Working in a coal mine. <clears throat> Dropping bombs. I, well, you know, I feel this has gone well. I mean, sure, I'm not going to face King Yama today. But it's given me renewed hope for the future, for sure. That, you know, one day I'll pull this off. And uh, I haven't completely lost all skill and talent at video games. You know, as you get older, you start to worry about these things. Am I still the man I used to be? Am I still virile? Are my reflexes as tight? You know, I, and I find myself just unable to perform for as long as I, I, I you know, used to expecting myself. This is getting really personal. And there we go. Olmec defeated. Mad loot is mine. But it's not hell. It's a hollow victory. Uh Whee! Boom. You know, I mean, the parachute saves him, but the jetpack can't. That doesn't make sense to me. Dala. Right, so, uh, thanks so much for watching. 
And uh, maybe next time I actually will make it to hell. Who knows? Hard to tell. Uh, if it will let me finish this thing. There we go. Not that I don't like to see the credits, I do. But rank 48? Hey, that's not bad. We'll see you tomorrow.